Hey guys, welcome back to Tony Zatus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to download Adobe Photoshop. Before we start, hurry up and check out our data software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be worrying, how do you download Adobe Photoshop here? Well, the thing here is for us to download Photoshop, we need to access or buy the product itself from Adobe. So in this case, go ahead and open up any browser that you have on your PC. Just type in Adobe here. And from here, look for Adobe Creative Marketing and Document Management. Let's go ahead and open it up. Now from here, what we need to do next is we need to actually create our account, which in this case, uh, you could go ahead and create one by clicking on your name at the, or basically the sign up button at the top right of your screen. So just to give you an idea, I'm going to sign out here since I already have an account. So typically you have the sign in button. Let's go ahead and click on it. And from here, you want to actually create an account. Go ahead and click on create an account and choose whatever method that you want. So you can create manually or even create it via Google, Facebook, or even your Apple account or Microsoft account. So in this case, create your account. And once you've created your account, you should now be in the home screen for Adobe. Now, what you need to do is we need to look for the plan for Photoshop. Now, also, well, the great thing about Adobe here is they actually allow you to try Photoshop here for free. So they offer a free trial for Photoshop just in case if you want to try it first. But at the very top right, you have the plans and products. Let's go ahead and click on it. Click on view all plans. And from here, it will redirect you to the Creative Cloud pricing section. In this case, you could go ahead and choose either the, la the language that you want to choose. So in this case, uh, let's go ahead and choose our uh, language as well as a location. And uh, from here, what we need to do next is we need to actually uh, choose or buy Photoshop. In this case, you could go ahead and scroll down a bit here. And from here, you'll have a different plan. So you have Photoshop here and depending on your current region, the pricing itself might be different. So in my case, Photoshop is going to be around 1,146 Philippine Peso. Now, in this case, you could go ahead and click on the Buy Now button, and you could also add a 30 day free trial to of Adobe Stock. So that includes uh, some stock images and photos or videos from Adobe themselves. Let's go ahead and click on Buy Now. And from here, you need to choose your plan. So in this case, I either choose monthly, annually paid monthly so you'll be able to save more and we have annual prepaid this case for example is going to choose monthly here let's go click, click on buy now and from here you just need to check out so you need to provide your payment details in this case either choose credit uh, credit debit or paypal here in this case once you provide all the payment details you go and click on agree and subscribe and you should be able to add this app into your account now, once you've purchased the actual app, it should redirect you to the next section, which in this case is going to be the welcome page of your account. Now, go ahead and click on the access or view apps and uh, services that you have right now. So typically, it's going to be a button that says access your apps and services. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now, the next page, you just need to look for Adobe Photoshop here. And once you see it, go ahead and click on the install button if you haven't installed it. But in this case, if you already installed it, it's going to appear under install. But again, if it's not yet installed, you could choose or uh, click on the install button for Photoshop there. Now, in this case, it will automatically install the app itself for on your PC. You just need to follow the on-screen steps or the steps uh, to actually install it. So they will guide you. So don't worry on this one. Adobe will guide you on installing this one. They actually pre-package it, pre it. So you just need to click on next and just choose some preferences here and there and you should be good and that's about it so if you found this video helpful hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video